What's up, ladies and gentlemen? I'm Nominal Giant, and I just wanted to welcome you to the first episode of Hitman Absolution. This is a game I played on the Xbox 360, and I kind of really fell in love with it, like I do with all Hitman games. Hitman games. <laughs> um, but... I got to a point where I got stuck, and I ended up just kind of forgetting about the game, much like my ADD brain does. So, <laughs> what we're going to do here is we're going to play this game on the YouTubes for you, and uh, I'm, I'm going to play it for you. I started a previous campaign because I was testing my audio and video and stuff like that, but um, hopefully, uh, well actually not hopefully, we're just going to start a new game. And hopefully you guys enjoy it because this is a fantastic freaking game and uh, you'd be crazy not to like it. So let's get started. We're just going to play it on normal for now and then we might go on from there later on. So let's do this. Listen to me. I need you to be brave. A man will come and take you away. I cannot go with you. This is how it has to be. This man is different. He will protect you. Please don't judge him for what he might do. I'm sorry. Maybe someday, you will understand. Forty-seven. This is Benjamin Travis. The money has been wired to your account. Welcome to Chicago. I appreciate you taking this assignment, 47. It is never easy targeting our own, but Diana Burnwood's treason must be dealt with. I would send in one of the teams, but this is a job for a scalpel, not a hammer. Reasons are irrelevant. Exactly. Good luck, 47. It's an ice cream truck. Yeah, I know. I'll get rid of him. Hey, get out of here. We don't want anything. What about your partner? What partner? During this assignment, key game elements will be highlighted. First of all, try to kill with discretion and try to remain undetected. Will do. Let's look at the interface. In the lower left corner, the blue bar indicates your health. Next to it is the radar. Use it to keep track of enemies, objectives, and exit points. Okay. In the, Oops. the lower right corner, you can see what weapon you have selected and if it's hidden. Next to the weapon, the yellow bar indicates how much instinct you have available. If it is depleted, you cannot rely on instinct abilities. Oh man. Alright, we're back guys. I just had to do a quick cut for a second there. I forgot to do my audio syncing because I'm using Fraps to record my gameplay because DX Story hates me. 
Um, so I'm using Fraps. Gonna get huge file sizes, but I decided because Fraps does this weird audio compression thing, I don't. I decided I didn't like that, and I decided I decided to use Adobe Audition to record my audio. Hopefully, it doesn't get weird and buggy. According to ICA Division Chief Benjamin Travis, my former handler Diana Burnwood has gone rogue, taking with her a valuable agency asset, a girl named Victoria. After months underground, Diana's safe house has been located, a heavily guarded mansion on the shores of Lake Michigan. My objective? Eliminate Diana. And oh, man. Man, oh, man. Personal man. Personal note. Diana saved my life. Although the grounds for termination are just, I take no pride in this assignment. From here on out, I shall refer to her only as my target. Man, that sucks. Let's not get personally involved. <laughs> that sucks. Okay, so let's look at some of the challenges. Oh, by the way, before I start, I've played most of the uh, Hitman games, um, and I intend to play them here for you guys. The problem is, though, most of them up till Absolution have weird resolutions for my computer. I'm going to have a hard time recording them, I think. I'm going to play around with it and see what happens. But for now, we're just going to stick to Hitman Absolution because, in my opinion, um, aside from the second one, it is the best game in the series. So let's check out some of the challenges here. Personal Contracts, Chameleon, Gardener, uh-huh, yep, yep. Pick up the disguises, Gardener. Mansion interior guard chef. I can do that Cliffside mansion ground floor. So let's just do the disguises in this go around. Huh? Not sure how all this stuff works um, Hopefully the video is about to enter a restricted area. this lady needs to stop the talking ahead will try to arrest <laughs> you if he spots you so keep low and try to slip past unnoticed All right low and unnoticed so Approach yeah. the cover in front of you when you are in cover it is harder for your enemies to spot you it's really hard to talk when that lady wants to talk all the time. Can be used as close combat weapons, or you can use them to distract your enemies. Throw the wrench at the buckets to distract the guard. Excellent. Slip past while the guard is distracted. Anyone there? All right, slip and pass. Slip and pass. Go, 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 go. No, I will not. <laughs> Actually, let me uh, let me turn down my audio for a second, or real quick. Uh, sound, master volume, cut down to 50, effect volume down to 50, music down to 50, and we'll take voice just a little bit above all that other stuff. Okay, cool. Because I don't know how it sounds to you guys, but it's really just blowing my ears out. Okay, get the ball. You aim, aim for the head, then increase yeah. your precision by steadying your aim. Got him. Right Clean in... Kill. Remember the, to hide the base body. of the spine. Bodies left in plain sight will alert your enemies. The, this is one of my favorite games because I just I love stealthy games, guys. You don't even know. It's like I would love to play um, Splinter Cell for you guys, but I don't think it's on Steam. And the body I, is now hidden. I don't the have any. Has room for mm -hmm. one more body and still has room for <laughs> you to hide. I don't have any hard copies of it or anything like that on disc or whatever. But I'll, I'll work on that too. Weapon. Uh, fiber of the wire. I'll work on that too. To silently eliminate the guard up ahead. But I'm definitely gonna try to play Splinter Cell for you guys. Listen to this guy talk. Something must have gotten her spooked. Clean yeah. kill. Notice the fiber wire allows you to drag your target immediately. Oh, I killed him. He did. He is dead. So how you guys doing? How you been? I've been gone for a really long time, guys. Like, I don't know, almost a year from YouTube because I was streaming a lot. But um. I had to quit streaming because I got a new job, and um, my schedule just doesn't allow for me to stream very much. However, I can do YouTube because I only do a couple of videos, and it only takes me about 30 minutes to an hour to record, maybe a video or two, and then another uh, hour to edit, maybe, not even. So um, it's a lot easier for me to do YouTube and pump out continuous content rather than doing streaming just once a week Clean or so. Kill. Remember to hide the body. Yep. Bodies left in plain sight will alert. You have activated a checkpoint. If you die or if you choose to restart, you will start at this location. Mm -hmm. And I, I realize I, I know a lot of you guys came from my uh, streaming channel, and I appreciate you guys so much for sticking with me 
coming over to YouTube and following me here. Um, Agent Forty Seven. It means so much to me. And supreme senses allow him to keenly perceive his surroundings. Keenly. So I could probably take this guy out, and I will. Come here. Subdue or kill. The choice is yours. Just gonna subdue him because he didn't do anything to me. Just choke him out. Either yep. Way, there we go. He won't be waking up any. That's soon. right. He won't be waking up anytime soon. Now this guy's gonna be the challenge. I'm probably gonna have to kill him. Uh, so. Here we go with that. Uh, visibly armed. Can I take him out before he sees me? Right in the eyeball. Oh my god, did you see that? Oh, um, I'm going to have to boost. I know Fraps likes to uh, crunch the brightness in video. So I'm going to have to brighten up the video so you guys can see everything again, which is fine. But I don't want you guys to miss little details like that because that was so freaking cool, man. Hey, hey. Ah, wow! You kidding me? Shoot! And I just did this a little bit ago. Use cover to the situation has been contained. Yeah, it has. Consider cleaning up before proceeding. Heck no! I don't need to clean up in this area. All right, guys, that is not the way to do it. <laughs> I mean, you could do this section right here. Um, you could do it stealthy or m with murderous intent. But, um, you know, it kind of just depends on your play style. This game gives you a lot of options to decide ooh, what you want to do, how you want to do it, things like that. Um, so I've got to get past these guys and get to this door over here so I can get to the next, the next area. Use instinct or consult the radar to locate the exit. Looks like, looks like I might be able to get around. Maybe. And either way, you can be damn sure it's Use some instincts. So I can just skitter around these fools. Um, are you gonna be all right, Hank? There we go. <laughs> are you gonna be all right, Hank? All right, made it through. Nice, very, very nice, very nice. All right. Use instinct to anticipate enemy movement. Looks like the, chef the guard is headed for the railing and will not reach you. Nice. Edged and piercing weapons can be used for deadly throws as well as distractions. <laughs> yeah, they can. And we're going to mess this guy up. Now throw. There it is. Right in the back of the head. Oh, God. So dirty. I'll dump the body over the railing in just a minute after I get this guy out on ground. Pika! <laughs> and uh, I just want to warn you guys. Uh, for you that are new to me, I watch a lot of B00 and a lot of generic B and Pungens. Name drops, by the way. No. <laughs> I watch a lot of those guys, so I've... Sometimes I have some of their mannerisms. Like that pay ah thing. It's a B-Dub thing. I'll try not to do it so much. Um, because I'm my own man. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's, uh, that's what that's all about. Okay, we're making good time here. Um... So we've got to get the gardener's outfit. I don't know how I'm going to do that, though. Oh, no, I tossed the guards over the edge. Shoot. <laughs> um, okay. The greenhouse up ahead will require a disguise to infiltrate unnoticed. Oh. Is this disguise? For a disguise. As of now, garden personnel are no <laughs> longer allowed inside the garden for two ex-presidents and even the secret service will mess up the you are disguised oh, good. as a guard. Nice. In this disguise, you are allowed to be in the greenhouse area. Cool. Be mindful that other gardeners see through your disguise if you come too close. So keep a safe distance. Getting yep. into the greenhouse will bring you close to the gardener. Trick the gardener. Yep. Oh shit! I hey, let's go. Ever hear a personal space? Sorry. Now I'm not sure what to do in here. It's been a really long time. Suspicious. But you should keep a lookout for other gardeners. Mm hmm That gardener right there. Don't look at me. As far as I know, the girl hasn't let the house. Don't look at me. Stop looking at me. Alright, what's the objective in here? Um oh, I'm looking at the wrong thing. Uh okay, so I got chameleon. 
I have got garden. So the mansion interior guard and the chef I can get inside. Objectives. Infiltrate greenhouse. According to ICA division chief. We'll let him explain. Benjamin Travis. My former handler, Diana Burnwood, has gone rogue. Taking with her a valuable agency asset. A girl named Victoria. After months underground, Diana's safe house has been located. A heavily guarded mansion on the shores of Lake Michigan. My objective? Eliminate Diana and retrieve the girl. Okay. Personal note. <sighs> Diana saved my life. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Well, the grounds for termination are just. I take no pride in this assignment. Is From it? here on out. Jesus. I shall refer to her only as my time. <laughs> He's got a pretty... Get personally involved. He's got a pretty cool voice. I like it. Intel indicates a staff of non-combat gardeners maintaining the greenhouse. An opportunity to progress unnoticed. So if I use my instinct is the exit, use my instinct, walk around this side. I've got to walk through here unnoticed. Look for a way to distract them. No. Okay, I'm sorry. Sir, listen to him, Baldy. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. You really are stupid. You want me to call the cop? No. We're good. Sir, you heard him. Please leave the area. That's it. One foot in front of the other. Thank you. The guards have been dealt with. Doing so, you regain some instinct. I don't think you should be here. You don't know anything. The guards are preoccupied. You can kill them or sneak past. The choice is yours. Why are you hassling me, dude? You? Who the hell are you? Your disguise is blown. Shit. Enemies will be looking for a gardener. You are being arrested. Do not run. <laughs> Instead, fake surrender or calmly walk to a secluded All right. area. Then deal All right. with your enemy. Hi. Excuse me. Excuse me. Just run. Just run. Just run. Ooh. Okay. Yep. Use cover to protect yourself from enemy fire or try to slip away and hide. Oh, ow. allows you to relocate quickly. There we go. Climb down. Good. Infiltrate the mansion and terminate Diana Burnwood. Boy. I botched that. Unharmed. She is very dear to me and the agency. What? You're kidding. What's going on up here? It's not prostate cancer. Hi. <laughs> I could kiss you. No. See you later. Okay, we'll just climb through the oh, window. Witnesses. You are now inside the mansion. Your current disguise will be suspicious to the mansion guards. Do Either I have that knife still? Or try to remain undetected. I do not. But I do have the piano wire. And we'll use that to kill this guy. You okay, bruh? You dead as hell. Mm-hmm. And I put him behind a bar, because I think that might be... No, 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 no. I'd use my disguise. I get his disguise. Disguise up like him. The mansion guard disguise gives you full yes. access to the mansion interior. Be mindful that other mansion guards see through your disguise if you come too close. So keep a safe distance. Yep. Safe distance. Sure. That's exactly what we'll do, is keep a safe distance. Dissidents, dissidents. <laughs> oh boy, hit this checkpoint, and I guess we'll call it here, guys, because, um, yeah, it's been, it's been about 19, 20 minutes. I don't want to get uh, too wrapped up in the first episode, because uh, this pretty much is just a, really a test video to see if this game is watchable and whatnot, and the audio is good. And oh, excuse me, see if I can. Stupid phone. See if I can. Uh, <laughs> see if I can uh, get the audio synced up things like that so that being said guys I love your faces and I'll see you in the next episode actually wait that was a bad e exit and besides I've still got more to tell you guys what am I doing as far as WWE 2k15 is concerned I will be doing more I had to make a new character um, still the same style and everything like that I did a lot for the intros I did a lot of customization and I have been training 
so I could get a little bit better at the game. That way you guys aren't laughing at me through the whole dang episodes in the series. So, now, with that said, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, destroy that like button. Just, just, just press it a lot and see if you can blow up the YouTubes liking my video. <laughs> I love your faces, guys, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.